Today, we'll show you how to calibrate CB Supply's Ivar Hydronics heating manifold. If you're an installer, this quick video will show you the step-by-step -step instructions to assist you in the calibration process of your next hydronics heating installation project. By doing so, you'll minimize any uncertainty and ensure accuracy of your manifold. Our calibration process is simple and easy. The CSA B214 installation code for hydronic heating systems requires that all multi-zoned hydronic systems be calibrated properly to flow to all heat emitters. An ideal way to calibrate all zones is through a properly designed manifold equipped with flow meters. CB Supply's IVAR manifolds are designed and assembled to accurately deliver the proper flow rate to each loop of the manifold. The IVAR manifold comes complete with header isolator valves, thermometers, flow meters, circuit isolator valves, fill slash purge ports, and is mounted on brackets. The manifold comes complete with all these parts. Therefore, there is no risk of missing parts once you're at your installation site. Let's get started. Once you have purged the air from your system and started the circulation of the fluid, you must adjust the flow rate in each one of the circuits as per the design calculations done for the system. Start with removing the orange grab rings from each one of the flow meters, exposing two adjustment nuts, one for the actual calibration of the circuit and the bottom nut which acts as a locking ring. If the calibrating nut is turned clockwise, the flow rate will decrease. If it is turned counterclockwise, the flow rate will increase. Once you have calibrated to the necessary flow rate, turn the bottom ring counterclockwise to lock the mechanism to set the flow rate point. You can now reinstall the orange grab rings. You will then be able to close the flow totally, and when you reopen the flow, it will return to its initial set point. You will also note that the vial on the flow meter can be removed for cleaning even when the manifold is under pressure. The circuit isolation cap on the return header is double-threaded. The bottom thread is for securing it to the manifold, while the other thread is for the manual isolation of the circuit. All adjustments should be done manually. The use of hand tools could damage the flow meters and return circuit isolator caps and is not recommended. As simple as that, your IVAR manifold is now calibrated.